Hi guys, happy Sunday and welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of the CVS. We're about to head in here and check out some deals. I'm gonna walk you through the deals in the store. Plus I'll have a printable list below the video so you can print that out, take it to the store with you and it's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy. Now let me know in the comments below if you got some good CRTs. I've not even looked at mine this morning yet so I'm kind of going into it. Like, <laughs> don't even know what I'm doing yet. But I do have some idea what I want to do depending on what CRTs I get. So there's that. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to see what we can pick up. If you are completely new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for being here. And if you enjoy the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up as well as hit that red subscribe button below and the notification bell so you don't miss any new ones. Now let's go ahead and check out these deals. All right, guys, so the first deal I'm picking up is on the Hallmark products. We're going to grab this paper. It's so pretty. I've been waiting to get this. It's $4.99. I'm also going to grab some of these little bags. They are $0.49 cents each, and I'm going to grab seven of them. So my total is going to be $8.42 with all the bags plus the wrapping paper. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because I have two Hallmark CRTs for $4 off of eight items. So that's going to take $8 off my total. So for all of this, it's going to cost me just 42 cents. Now next up, I'm going to do the CoverGirl deal. So nothing is tagged here at my store today, but it's buy three, get an $8 extra buck. So I'm going to grab this face makeup for $11.49. I'm also going to grab one of these newer lip balms. I've been wanting to try one of these for $6.79. And then I'm going to go over and grab one of those eye pencils that we get all the time for $6.29 because it's the cheapest item. So all of these are gonna total me $24.57. So if your store follows a 98% rule, if you have a coupon, say for eight off of 25, you're at the 98% mark on there to meet that. So I'm gonna use these two paper coupons. They did expire yesterday, but most CVS stores will take coupons expired up to 15 days. As long as they scan, it should be good on that. So I'm gonna use those two coupons. Plus, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use the um, 8 off of 25 CRT. So after the $8 extra care buck back, it's going to make my final cost just $0.57 cents for all three of these, which I think is a great deal. Next, we have a great deal for summertime on the Copper Tone. It's spin 20, get a $10 extra buck. And the cheapest ones here at my store are $11.99. So you may have other ones to choose from, but I'm gonna grab two of these. That's gonna total me $23.98. We do have two digital coupons for $2 off of one. So use both of those. If you have a three off 12 sunscreen CRT, you could use that. It'll get you down to $16.98, get a $10 extra buck. Makes your final cost $6.98 for two or if you have a five off two coupon from today's insert, if you wanna use that instead of the two $2 digitals, your final cost would be $5.98 for both of these sunscreen. Next, we have a really easy oral care deal this week because the Colgate is two for $9.98. I'm gonna grab four for a total of $19.96. I'm using a $3 digital, a $1 digital, and a four off 20 CRT. We're gonna pay $11.96, but get a $12 extra buck because this deal is a limit of two. So your final cost will be completely free for all four. All right, guys, so it's a small haul today. I was gonna look around for extra deals, but these are the coupons I'm using. I'm gonna use some extra bucks to lower my out of pocket. None of this stuff was tagged yet at my store today, so I may have missed something, but we're gonna go ahead and check out. All right, guys, so we are back in the car from CVS. The transaction went pretty smooth. Okay, so let me ask you guys this. Do you ever, like if you shop early, I don't know, if you ever par pull in the parking lot of the store that you go to, if there's only like say like one or two employees something like that you might recognize their car because normally when you pull up it's their car and your car is the only ones there or something so anyways um every time i pull up to the cvs that i go to um there's normally like one or two cars here and i know the two employees that normally work here um i see them each week they kind of rotate so i'm like hey how are you you know all that so anyways you know i don't know them know them but 
I've seen them in here a lot. So, um, anyways, this morning when I pulled up, there was a different car in the parking lot than normal. So it made me kind of nervous. I was like, did one of them get a new car or is there a new cashier? Cause you know, sometimes like you feel nervous if there's a new cashier somewhere that, you know, you maybe haven't had before. You don't know what they're going to be like, but there was a new cashier this morning, but she was really nice. Um, and I know that's going to give the couple of guys that normally work a break. So that's nice. And, um, yeah, it went really smooth so worried for nothing but anyways we're gonna go ahead we're gonna head home look over this receipt and talk final cost of all of our items all right guys so i am back home and this is my cvs haul for this week so it is a smaller haul but hey i think i got some good items honestly the things i'm the most excited about is sunscreen always love getting a good deal on those and then also the wrapping paper and I want to I want to try that CoverGirl lip balm and then also the CoverGirl makeup. I can use that kind. At least I think I got the right shade. Anyways, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to go over the receipt. I did think that everything went perfectly and then I realized that there was one issue, but that's okay. I'm thinking that maybe next week if one of the cashiers I normally have is there, they may credit me. Um because I did take a screenshot of the coupon that didn't come off. And then of course I have my receipt, so I don't know. We'll see, they may or may not. Either way, it's still a good deal and I paid very little out of pocket, but let's go ahead and look this over. So you can see right here on the receipt, all of our items. Then down here, we've got our coupons. So the two paper coupons I used were those CoverGirl coupons. Not all stores will take the coupons if they're expired one day. Like those are expired yesterday, the 25th. But a lot of CVS stores, the coupons will scan up to 15 days expired. Then once it passes that point, it'll pop up a message saying that, you know, it's expired, you can't take it. But um, yeah, so didn't have any issue with those. Then for my digitals, it's weird because I gave her a five off two paper coupon uh, for the copper tone but for some reason um, instead of it taking my 5 of 2 digital I mean 5 of 2 paper coupon which I think she did scan it only took the two digital so that I got four dollars in savings versus five dollars savings so that was you know one dollar missing in savings there um, then for the Colgate, we had our $3 digital and $1 digital coupon. Um, over here, we've got our six off a $30 purchase, two of the four off eight Hallmark CRTs that came off. The missing CRT that I didn't realize was my eight off of 25 CoverGirl. So I did meet that requirement for that, but for some reason it didn't come off. And I'll show you a little later in my receipt, maybe why that happened, I'm not for sure. But, um, I don't know because it doesn't really make sense but anyway so that didn't come off so hopefully they'll credit me that eight dollars but then all these down here are my extra care bucks that i use so i use my ten dollar care pass which only cost you five dollars a month so i mean that's a really good deal right there and then we've got all the other extra bucks that i used now you can see right down here i had two other five dollar extra care bucks down here i think when i was telling her i gave her some paper coupons and then i gave her uh, or I told her I want to use my care pass and then I wanted to apply a few of my extra bucks that I had that were digital on my account. So maybe those two got applied and then my eight off 25 didn't come off. But the only thing that doesn't make sense about that to me is that normally it will take off your other coupons and then it'll just adjust down your extra bucks. Like so for example, if I didn't need $10 worth, it's almost like it would just adjust it down to like say if you only need $2 or whatever the case may be. Um, so I'm not sure, maybe there was just some issue with that coupon itself not coming off and I didn't even need to use that many extra care bucks and all that because obviously you can see my subtotal was $1.93. So we had 98% savings there. Now in extra bucks bag, I got $10, $12, and eight dollars so the ten dollars was for the copper tone deal the twelve dollars was for the colgate because we did that deal twice and then we got eight dollars for buying three covergirl products now this transaction i'm going to try to explain it the best i can so my total was a dollar 93 but i used 41 dollars in extra care bucks but we're going to look at it okay if you add that back in if you're not using extra care bucks or even if you are your total after the coupons that we talked about would have been $42.93. But if your eight off 25 for CoverGirl comes off, then you are gonna pay $34.93. So after getting that $8 back, it's like I paid $34.93. Then 
on this, you're gonna get back the $10 extra buck, the $12 extra buck, and the $8 extra buck. So I hope that makes sense. Anyways, it makes the final cost for all of this $4.93, which I don't think is bad, less than $5, and those sunscreen are $11.99 each, so that's crazy. I mean, even at Walmart, you couldn't get those sunscreen for probably less than, what, like, I don't know, eight bucks each, maybe even more with all the prices going up, but definitely let me know in the comments below if you're going to grab any of these same deals. I appreciate you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.